radical policies of this Prime Minister and the NDP mayor in Vancouver led that city to more violence, to be on track for a record number of overdose deaths. But vo voters in Vancouver have said enough. They have fired the NDP mayor and rejected the radical policies and instead voted to remove the gatekeepers to build more affordable homes and bring in common sense laws to restore safe streets. This guy is lightning in a bottle. I love how he calls a spade a spade here. He gives you the straight facts, Jack, straight up, no chaser. Let's get these NDP communists, these wokesters out of power and replace it with some form of reasonable, responsible leadership here. On that note, I've been asked a lot about Ken Sim. What do I think of this guy, this new mayor? I'm not sure that he's going to be a game changer. I hope that he is. I hope that he proves me wrong. However, I do think he'll bring some semblance of common sense back to the city, maybe a little bit more business-friendly environment. Maybe he can help help out some of the small businesses, in, small businesses in Chinatown, that kind of thing. I also think this administration will probably be a little bit more accountable to the taxpayer. I'm hoping anyway. You know, I, I feel like the, under Kennedy Stewart, we've been just raked against the coals here for years and years. Property taxes up 20% in the last couple of years. Strata fees, insurance premiums skyrocketing. Everything's getting more expensive in this city. I think this guy has been a complete failure on all accounts. In fact, I was never a big supporter of the former mayor, uh, Mayor Moonbeam here. This guy has actually been worse, if you can believe it or not. I never would have thought that would be possible. But I'm glad that this guy is, is you know, Vancouver got together and voted him out. Really happy about that. On that note, I am a Vancouver-based realtor. If you have any questions about the market, you can always reach me. Let's have a conversation about real estate. I'm Jay Kupar. I'll see you in the next video.